Hello my friends. Today we will do a yellow cape boss rush run. If you remember, the only crusade we lost was because of the double damage from the yellow cape. Will it happen again? Stay tuned to find out. And please enjoy the video. Welcome back my friends to Cult of the Lamb. In the last part we made our first run through the purgatory and we drugged our uh, clan up and also provided them with um, yeah, enough food so that I don't have to hunger for three days. And today we will probably go on one or two more crusades. Um, please leader, there are some folks who are starving and have no place to call home. We must let them join. Alright, let them join. We Let's see if they will still starve when we have the um, our cold cannot hunger trade online. <laughs> It looks like they can still starve. Okay, then we have to make some food in a second. Those quests are really profitable. We will get two members every time someone comes to us and says, Oh, there are two dudes. They have some problem. Okay, we still have food. Um, yeah, let's give them some cauliflower food. We have to seed up here. I think the bats are more than enough. Mm -hmm. Let's get everything into shape. Oh. Yeah, we have completed your quest. Be glad. And for that nice interaction. You can also have this one. And it, it said sacrifice is key. Maybe he will get more loyal when we sacrifice more members. <laughs> but I don't know. We will probably find out at some point. Uh, we had a level up again. So we can upgrade our crypt. Awesome. Let's receive the devotion. <laughs> Maybe upgrade our crypt just because we can. And our followers like it when we build structures. No, don't die. We need to be fast. Uh, we will bandage him up. No, go away guys. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Let's put him in the crypt right away. Stop puking, you couldn't even see him. He was there for a second. You guys are cheating. Okay, we need more... Um, more dung. Okay, let's upgrade our graveyards. And what else do we need? No, nothing. Let's give them some seeds down here. And this should work out for the day. Let's go on a crusade, I would say it. This is our next task. Oh, mm. before we go on the crusade, we have to see if the cooldown for our money collection thing is up. Because we are running quite low on re <laughs> load. We are quite not so loaded on money. And all of our consecration tables are... Oh, one more. That's the dude we just got. Uh, all of our consecration tables are out of... Not service. They are not working right now. <laughs> so we have to um, fire them up as well. This takes so much, so much time. <laughs> and we can go for a ceremony. It seems like the night has passed. Okay, donate to me, follower. Yeah, that's a good source of income. Not those stupid tax collectors that feel like they are completely worthless. I want to sacrifice members again. <laughs> Let's see, we should be able to get a level up easily. Okay, we got the curses. 
What is this one? Resummon a weapon or curse, but its level will be reduced. No. Let's just go for the relics and after that we can upgrade the weapons. Yeah, more relics for us. But there are still seven relics locked. And I don't know how we should unlock them, but we will find out at some point. Okay. That's fine for today. 1300. No, don't do it. Why are we stuck? Ah, uh, that was so wasted. And now we. <laughs> I've talked to the tax collector. Oh my god. I would love to have a button which would allow me to instantly do this gesture to everyone that's close to me. That would make the game so much more easy. And I would feel way more in control of what I'm doing. Okay, we can go for way more gold now. I want to have the big bang when I collect the resources. We will let them inside now. <laughs> Oh, and our followers returned, so we have two more. They look like they were successful. Hey guys, I've returned, big success. Yeah, there's a new friend. I've returned, big success. And he's always, oh no, it was the Bones one. Hello, Mr. Uh, Hedgehog. Is your name Sonic? Oh, that was funny. Uh, go refine materials. Okay, now we will gonna go on the crusade before... Before we get stuck again. We can go on a double crusade or a purgatory and a crusade every time now. Oh. Um... What is what is the difference? Fleece of the lamp, a noble garb provides no bonuses. Oh, boss rush and dungeon gauntlet. Oh, nice. We will even get new variations, and it seems like we have to do it multiple times per cape. The boss rush. I want to see the boss rush with double damage. Let's do a boss rush with double damage. <laughs> Yeah, this will... Oh, we can choose one? I think we will fail this one. But we got the hammer. Oh no, it's not the double damage one. It's the increased damage, but take double. Oh, I'm so stupid. This is the worst one we could have taken. There are no rooms to... Uh, increase our damage. Except for the boss spawns. Okay, but we are dealing a lot of damage and... But the boss did not spawn anything, that's bad. A uh, chance to summon a ghost. We have the necrotic camera. No. The storm of lightning. Oh, we can only choose one. <laughs> I thought we can get every single one. Plus 5% damage. Wow, that's totally worth it. Oh no, not you. Storm of lightning shall rain upon you. But he is giving a lot of a lot of minions. So let's increase our damage by as much as we can and oh, don't get hit. Can we hit him? No, he survived. Let's see, but maybe we can increase our Oh no! Oh, the knockback saved us! Yeah, the increased damage is just insane, as long as you don't get hit. A chance to heal. Random relic. A projectile. We have the shotgun. Vampiric hammer, but it's 23. 14 damage. Yeah, we would take the upgrade. This is 12. Yeah. That was worth it. <laughs> okay. Okay. 
Oh no! Oh, he just shot right in our face. <laughs> I didn't like expect him to attack immediately at all. Nah, we were so good in damage. Okay, dodging, dodging. Oh. Pow. Take this. Okay. Yeah, he's dead. Yeah, I like the cape. <laughs> but it's so risky. Okay, the, dem uh, the level of those things will increase super fast. Gain a diseased heart or chance to deal damage to all enemies. This sounds really good. Collect some tears of the god. I think we cannot choose the free order. Instead we will skip over the ones that we are not choosing right away. And we get a heart. Okay, let's just go for one hit, one dodge. Oh, no, this is a close call. Okay. Oh my goodness. Yeah! Rain down on me, enemies. No! Oh, that was so good. <laughs> Stop it! Okay, the god tier. I like the boss rush mode. That's fun. And it's a challenge. Okay, return to the call. Pachung! 100 already. But we got two more and that's nice. We can roll two times. And the purgatory is done for today. But let's gamble a bit. No, not this one. <laughs> Unless you give me new tarot cards. I don't want follower looks. Another one, no. Worst outcome we could have gotten. But the owl looks funny, so it's fine. We got the old dude, we freed him. Let's go to Anura. Into Hackett's area. We get the dagger and the bomb. Wow. And I got hit in the first second of the first room because they used a bow. That's mean. Pow, pow, pow. <laughs> I don't want to have my diseased heart anyway, so who cares? Hello. Foul beast, you dare trap me there. If you insist, I suffer, so shall you. No, a dude has reached old age. The low damage dagger is really risky. <laughs> Okay, this could be a bad run. Come back. But only because I'm greeting for damage <laughs> way too much. Yeah, okay. More. More. There will be so much more. Okay. Okay, concentration. I complained about the game. About the game being too easy, so 
the game will show to me that it's not as easy anymore in the end game. <laughs> Okay, we need to get out of here. Let me go, hack it. Okay, nice. Gain an extra heart. I hope it's full. <laughs> yes, okay. We are safe for now. I don't want to do this. Okay. Destroy the froggo. And another heart. <laughs> We are so lucky that we don't get punished for real after this big chain of misplays. Whoa. Okay, stop charging. No. I am way too reckless for the trade where the enemies will just um, spawn bullets out of their bodies. Oh, the Eye of Lashy. We could got, get more war. We can get health. We need the health. <laughs> Sorry, guy. I cannot pass on this order. Yeah. You will find your heart at some point. I believe in you, Ratu. Ha. <laughs> Forty-five. I want to have max devotion. That would be awesome. And I want like I would like to have a new weapon. <laughs> this dagger is crap. The little crit dagger. We need more attack speed or a better version of the dagger for it to be useful. Whoa, close call. <laughs> I got poisoned. Please, give me a different weapon. Decrease in size. I want to use the Eye of Lashy on the boss, so we keep it. Chuck, chuck, chuck. And you're down, and you go down, and you go down. Pow, pow, pow. Ouch. Oh man, this is so stupid. Okay. We get rewarded again with increased movement speed. No, the one thing that's totally useless. Oh, it's up there. <laughs> Oh, he's... Uh, I wanted to dodge, but I was too all-in on the attack. Oh yeah, please, another weapon. We will take the hammer. <laughs> Go away, stupid crit dagger. We have 400 mushrooms. Negating damage. Okay, we get hit so often. This is the best one we could have gotten. Pumpkins. We always take the seeds. Okay. Pow. No. Stop dodging. Okay, yeah. Finally some damage. <laughs> okay, now I'm getting weapons everywhere. No, I don't want the claw. Wow. I maybe will 
I want to do runs with the yellow cape again <laughs> because I like the damage increase even though it's the most risky um, possibility to not finish a run and I want to use uh, um, the cape which only allows us to attack with curses that was fun though we should do this for the next runs and I like the, um, the added challenge for the purgatory that you have to or you can choose an extra cape and get um, a different route or a bit different unlock when you choose it. So we can experiment and see different ra ways of playing <laughs> the endless modes. Chance to summon a ghost. Invincibility, we go for this one. It's just too good, we cannot pass up. Rondon. Two hearts, it's really possible that we die again. But we will go invincible and then just... Uh, I'm missing all the time. <laughs> Okay, be careful, my friend. They will not even die from one hit. <laughs> one, two, and one more. And one more. Ah, he hit us. No. Please die. <laughs> that was way too close. I <laughs> was. 100% off. I got I forgot to use the eye again. If those are permanent, this would be insane. Okay, I will take the follower form. I don't care. I do not need the other two, so let's take the form. And we have run uh, finished the first run in Hackett's realm. Easy peasy. Continue. Let's see how our how our cold is doing. Yeah, we can put stuff in the consecration again. I think we will only do the basic needs this time, the ceremony. And then go directly for another purgatory <laughs> and a run. Okay, collect everything. So that we can give them new seats. I want to be max level. I, <laughs> I don't want to spend or collect any more devotion. It's enough. Enough is enough. And maybe we should go all in on the sleeping quarters upgrading. No. Didn't want to talk to you. Alright. Alright. Let's see. Sleeping quarters. Yeah. Why do we need the poop of the followers to upgrade those? <laughs> You've constructed a grand shelter. Materialistic trait activated. Hello. Leader. Oh. I couldn't. Well, I could have read what he said, but I. <laughs> I accidentally skipped it. Let's hope the quest text will give us. Uh, some context. Perform the glory through toil. Ritual. Yeah, we can do this. Let's see which rituals are up. But let's... Oh no, ah, that was a misclick. <laughs> I didn't want to do the ceremony first. But we are still getting a level up. 
Um, let's upgrade the axe first. Range by throwing. Oh no, it's a heavy attack. Oh god, this is not what I wanted to see. Okay, let's upgrade the axe mastery. Maybe it makes it good. Longer range. The one thing that was a problem with this strong attack was the, the short range. This could counteract it. Okay, let's go for a ritual. Is there an old guy in our row? Yeah, the unicorn. And you too. We will get another level up, but um, let's do the bad rituals first. If we have one. We have to do the toil whatever ritual. Enrichment, enlightenment, brainwashing, glory through toil. Okay, one dude wants to work. Wants you all to work three nice nights and days. So, I will grant him the wish. <laughs> oh, well, well, well. Oh. They are all so happy. But now I will sacrifice one of you old dudes. 55. 55. It must be you too. I will sacrifice the unicorn. We are only getting them to devotion level 4 or 5 before they die. We really have to go all in on one follower to get him to level 10. Um, let's go for the... I like the dagger. But let's go for the fist weapon. I want to test them. Give me your meat. Okay, I don't think we have to do some more rituals. Yeah, give me your stuff. All of you. Oh my god, we got all of them. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. And again, one ran away. <laughs> It's pretty good to have so many followers. Oh, holy moly, how many level ups did we have there? <laughs> Excellent. No problem, I will fulfill your quests. Okay, where are the dudes with the level ups? Not all of you have to work on the same building. <laughs> Okay, I can just click into the mess <laughs> and hope that I get one with the level up. Mm -hmm. It's going pretty well. The undying necklace was pretty good. Maybe we will have to offer this dude when he gets level 10. Dun 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 dun. Okay, this one does, did not have a level up. <laughs> okay, you have a level up. Okay, let's send the one with the 100% chance on the crusade. Yeah, yeah, there he is. We want followers. We will go all in on the follower <laughs> collection. 82% that's not good But I don't care A level 3 one 87% he's even better. Oh another level up Okay, okay, okay hmm, I don't think we will go on another purgatory run or they only take a few minutes, don't they? Yeah, let's go for one. Pretty fast. The time will not elapse, so it's fine. Even also the time in real life will not elapse. 
Okay, this one is for card that's beginning. Curse related tarot cards, yeah. Let's do another boss rush. I don't want to do a dungeon gauntlet because a dungeon gauntlet is just exactly the same thing as a normal crusade. Okay. Let's see, they are all upgraded. I think you will... Yeah, you will probably always get those. But the damage one is missing there. A throw, a death sweep. We will go for the throw. Oh, the super high speed. Uh, yeah, this one was annoying. But I think fighting him with Kurthus only is even a good way to fight him. <laughs> Unless we come to the point. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> yeah, this one is so hard. Leave me alone. Flaming shot. The tank tackle one could be better. Use a random relic. Oh man, I forgot again that it's only one time use or one choose. <laughs> yeah, but the one we have is good. The witness. Okay, I used a random relic and it looked like it did nothing. So, let's see. Yeah, I like the, I think the Curse Cave is the best one in the game because it changes up the playstyle of just hitting everything over and over again so much. Oh, I've rolled in the wrong direction. So bad. And I like the Curse playstyle. And it enables you so hard to go for it. It's just fun. I was always a fan of the idea in video games that spell based things or to um, say it differently. I never was a fan of the simplistic mana system where you would just run out of resources in a game and then you couldn't use it anymore because it would just make you not use the system at all or only when you have replenished items or anything. It's close to the um, to the spell slot system in D&D. I think it's a very bad system because you have to make a long rest with it which is not so common all the time and you have to preserve your resources between fights super hard. You cannot go all in, you cannot play your character to full strength. And I pretty much prefer having my character at full strength than preserving it and having this one special moment. Okay, this one would be bad. This one is also not so good. This one could be good and it's 23. Hmm. Let's test it out. I want to see how much damage it does. And I'm not going for the critical hits. <laughs> I forget it. Forgot it. So let's go for the critical hits with the single target attack. Okay, that wasn't a critical. That was a critical. And that was a critical. Collect the feather. Yeah, alright, calm down. Use a random relic. And what did we get? I don't know. He blocked the critical hit. <laughs> Uh, this one is way worse than the other one and I don't feel like it's dealing more damage even though it's just maybe the single target crit yeah that's good damage let's fill our resources up again okay a little bit scuffed but it worked out what are you the eye I think this one is the highest damage. I don't know what the relic does that we have right now, but 
It will have some use, so... We take it. Alright. Whoa. <laughs> okay, that is a good one. We have the shotgun. But I... Uh, we have a small boss fight, so it's not so easy to hit him with all the shots. But he's close to be dying already. Yeah, <laughs> the shotgun is so good. It just outclasses a lot of the spells when it's pure close fight single target damage. The heart. Okay, we did it. Okay, two more rolls for us. And the boss rush is pretty fast if you have a good run. I also like this aspect of it. Okay, let's roll two times and then we will end the part. Oh. Is he changing color all the time? <laughs> what will it be? Oh my god. Another of those. We can buy a new cape. Car. Now we have a reason to unlock all of the capes. Two more. Another one. And it's about time for another level up. So let's hope the game will be generous and give it to us. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's every 4th or 5th or something like this, between 4 and 6. And now that we have it, we have to spend it as well. There's no way around. But we will only go for the level up and not do everything right now. Har. Okay. I want an afterlife one. I like off offering my or sacrificing my mates. All cult members will gain the belief in afterlife trait. Only lose minus five faith when a follower dies. Perform a ritual at your temple that allows you to bring a dead follower back to life. This could be the key to getting high level follower. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's see what it costs to bring one dude back to life. 75 bones, that is no problem. And we can buy another cape. Uh, which one sounds funny? This one sounds funny. <laughs> we will do this run, this purgatory run next time. Um, let's equip the four tarot card one. Yes, for the next crusade. And let's see what the ritual does. Oh, it only minus 10. That's nothing. Okay, and we can bring everyone back. Let's bring back the level 4 follower and let's see how long they live. The unicorn. We got it back. Oh. Okay, <laughs> our friend the unicorn is back, nice, and here's the same level, we barely lose anything. Okay, that was the way to go. And the way to reach the high level followers, so that's fine. Okay guys, I will not get the level up now. Thanks for watching and I hope you are having the same amount of fun I have with this project. So please leave a comment and tune in next time if you want to. See you then, bye bye.